old-fashioned people like me would tell you to read. That you won't have time, but you can listen. You are all tech savvy, not like me. I do them. I, I love to turn the pages. What happened? Yeah. What happened? So that is communication. If I, I was just standing here. You all didn't know what was going to happen. So, this is what I mean about communication. If I'm not going to convey to you what I want to tell you, and you don't understand what I'm telling you, there's no point in talking, isn't it? So, do you think communication is very important? Yes. Yeah? yeah? Yes. You? Yes. yes, it is very important. And especially so that you're working in organizations and some of you who you're, you are going to work. Because that is dealing with all the channels in an organization from top to bottom, even to the lower ranks. So you have to be absolutely clear. All the channels have to be open. So I'm not going to go to the technicalities, but I can assure you, at this age and stage in my life, I have never ever failed any interview. Because man doesn't only earn bread, but they are the word catchers. The word catchers are going to win, I can assure you. I don't mean by glib talk and not to be honest. You have to be frank and honest. But when people tell you about so many rules, you know, bend forward, look into the eye, do this and do that. It's going to happen when you're genuine. You don't have to remember such things. It is just going to happen because you are going to speak the truth and the person, even if you go for an interview, will guess what you're saying. So no need for false accent. No need for anything add-ons which you will get caught easily. To be frank and open, clear, Clear. Your message has to be clear. Your thoughts have to be coherent. Your, what you're going to say has to be absolutely perceived. Because most of the time, we think of perception. Oh, that's my boss. Not good. Oh, that's my junior. Not good. No. You have to listen. When you listen, you learn. And you know what to do. So there are certain things, no, I'm not going to be like a school teacher, definitely no, because I am teaching in an engineering college, and I can tell you, they are not going to be the material, sorry, they're my students, but I, I'm trying to instill in them that to be marketable, to get a job, you need, you need to improve yourself, how you're going to communicate, just think. If Ravi Shankar sat at home and played the sitar, nobody would have known. So if you don't express yourself, you don't know how to say. For everything, for the youngsters, even like you, I'm sorry, I, I have noticed people talking. It's awesome. It's awesome. It's an awesome day. It's raining. It's awesome. It's bad weather. It's awesome. So when you're going to say, if a starry, beautiful night is there, so what are you going to say? Isn't that awesome? Awesome is something very spectacular. It's not awesome, something just, just not awesome. So you have to develop vocabulary. I know best way the old fashioned people like me would tell you to read. That you won't have time, but you can listen. You are all tech savvy, not like me. I do them, I, I love to turn the pages. But you can listen to people speak. Make friends with people who speak well and learn how to communicate because in your office scenario, definitely, definitely, there are going to be gossips, there are going to be negative talk, there are going to be so many things, but you should not pay heed to that. You should project yourself as a doer, and that are the positive words, the good words. You have to learn, you have to develop your vocabulary. To be honest with you, there's no other way you can you know, proceed in life because language is the language of speaking well is the language of a leader. A leader's 
you have you look up to people so there are certain exercises you may think i'm telling you uh, uh, it's something that is difficult to do it's not it's there are some breathing exercises because you know you get attracted to people who have deep voices we vote to the politicians because they speak well because of their deep voice so there are certain exercises like i can give you a demonstration um like ra 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 no i'm not saying it's not a war cry it's to roll your tongue it's to open your mouth so there are technicalities because most of the time if we are not speaking uh fluently that is not speaking out we swallow in the words we won't be sending the correct message and communication by the way does not mean only speaking it is written so just imagine if you are the boss and you have to write something and there are a lot of spelling mistakes grammatical mistakes oh dear what is is going to happen to your juniors so you have to pay heed to that so there are many many uh types of communication which one has to has to pay adhere to if you are going to succeed in your organizational uh ladder so take heed and do that what is necessary there are the seven rules of communication which you have must be knowing about it to be clear to have a good concept to be um courteous yes these things do matter when you're speaking to someone especially in an organization scenario you have to regard for age for status even in even to your peon you have to be courteous so these are the many ways of communicating your thoughts and your process in life to to excel in anything any matter any subject whether you are a teacher a businessman an entrepreneur if you speak well then you are the winner that's for sure so in case you need any help on this lines you can always connect to me because i can tell you i have opened a restaurant i have sold time share i have taught so you can see the different different uh, scenarios that i have faced being a liaison officer for a college pedagogy so all that is all because of the communication practice that i do and i do practice it's not that i i'm i'm not a i'm not a, a i wasn't born saying abcd i also learned i work on myself which all of you all of you have to if you want to excel and what you're going to achieve after you do you know the sky is the limit you can take up any profession anywhere and that is going to be your success story if you can speak well so speak well and do well and i say all the best to all of you to speak speak and speak and move forward thank you